So what all can a rear blade do for you? This is a standard rear blade that's the Rhino 50 series 6 foot blade. Very similar to the 70 series, but it's got a lot of features to it. One of the features is the ability to change the pivot, the tilt, and the offset on this blade. And I'm going to show you real quickly how to do that. On this pin here is going to change your pivot. You're going to be able to pivot in different positions. And if you look, we've got one, two, three, four, five holes here. That's five different positions. You'll line up this hole. Right there. And put your cotter pin back in. If you wanted to angle, if you want to pull material and dump it off to this side, this will pull gravel and dump here. Kind of like if you're wanting to keep a crown in a row. That is pivot. Pivot can also be done by swinging this blade 180 degrees will allow you to back up. If we look here, we've got three different positions. This will allow you three different positions. Middle is always going to be straight back and then you've got side to side. So you could push side to side angles if you wanted to. Or, like if you're pushing snow, a lot of people like to use the loader forward and the blade backwards. And this way, you can use it in combination that way. We'll just set up some crazy. Put that pin in there. Drops down, so we've got a rear angle. This, this part is what we call swing. Swing allows us to move our blade back and forth pull our pin here, that's always a good place to do it. You can see I can swing the blade side to side. Say I wanted to swing it over here, put the pin in there, that is going to be called swing. So we've got pivot swing, the next one is tilt, and I'm just going to pull this pin. Swing the blade. And I need to change this because we've got it too close there. And it was hitting on the, the bar. But if you want to do your that pin in. A good way to do it is just drop the pin in, swing it a little bit. Now we want to get our angle. We can get our angle on it. And this is going to be some pretty severe angle there. But what I want to show you is the tilt function. The tilt function is right back here on the 5006. You pull this pin and you can tilt the blade. To create a ditch. Now this probably is a little extreme. You didn't line your hole up there. line your hole up but if you were going to dig a ditch to pull material out of the ditch you can pull it up out of the ditch and up onto the top of your road to reclaim your rock. Tilt, pivot is this pin and swing is this pin. Rhino blades have a lot of different options to make it easy for you to do what you want with them and a lot of variability. Sometimes you're not going to use all these together in conjunction but you have it with Rhino 50 series and 70 series blades. The 35 series has the ability to do the same thing, but you manually operate your swing part. It does not have this swing here. It is done by, re by remounting the blade in different sets of holes. But swivet, pivot, and tilt 
available from Rhino Ag. Check out all their great products. They make great tractors even better.